Hi guys, thanks for checking the video out. Um, I've had quite a few questions about what does HPP mean. So in a lot of my playing videos, um, I've been doing a stuff with the university guys, some great golfers, but I've been putting more so in the descriptions and the HPP players and haven't really explained what that means. So thought I would take this opportunity. So HPP means High Performance Programme. So although you know me as the lovable buzzman from YouTube, uh, my main role in life is I'm the high performance coach to the University of Exeter. So I've been doing this, I've been up on site kind of full time since they built the facility I'm standing on now, the, the Vic Ambler Golf Centre. So when they, that one opened kind of June last year and since then I've, I've been based at the university. It's been a great opportunity to actually integrate the golf team back into kind of the university stuff so obviously we play off-site but we were doing a lot of our training off-site as well so what what does that involve so I, I basically i head up the coaching the guys are really lucky so they've got me so you would think that would be lucky enough but i mean they have strength and conditioning they have physiotherapists they've got access to nutrition psych psych if they need it and um, i mean they've also got um my boss, uh, the director of golf, who really oversees the program, does a lot of the admin. So, got a really professional sort of program going on here at the University of Exeter. Uh, in my first year, I mean, we got back to UK number one. So, we're the new UK number one golf program. So, that's that's pretty that's pretty good, and it's something that I'm really proud of, um, and I know the guys involved are as well. The, the way that the university structure works, um, we, we basically play a lot of match play in the first half of the year. And then as the year goes on, we'll play a few like qualifiers. So they, they tend to be like 54 whole events, but then once the match play stage is finished with the knockouts, um, we go into individual stuff. But yeah, we, um, we, we got our UK number one status because our, our teams, so like sort of the match play stuff, we did fantastically well. First team got knocked out in the quarterfinals to Birmingham. I mean, it was a shame that we lost, but a, a great day out. I mean, I was really proud of how we played, and um, it was a great one for golf, just to watch more so than anything. I mean, a bit of a shame that we lost, but I mean, that was it. That was a really good day out. Some really good golf played, and a, a good example of how strong UK golf is. But then the second team and the third team won both their respective leagues and then once the leagues are kind of a bit more regional, so we like play in the south of England, it then goes through into sort of the whole of the UK and both the second team and third team won those respective cups as well. So that was kind of how we got to UK number one. And yeah, it's, it's, it's been a, it's fantastic. It's great for my coaching because to have the opportunity to work with such good golfers it really develops me as a coach so yeah i'm really really lucky and happy to be based and associated with with this university program but yeah just why i do a quick video because again I, I think um a lot of people don't realize that's kind of what i do and it's it's the main purpose in life at the minute so um if you've got any other questions uh, get them get them down below and um, yeah, I'd, I'd love to answer them and I'd give you some more insight into, into what we're doing. doing the vi my video's coming up, I'm trying to involve the students a little bit more because A, they're, they're great golfers, but also they're a real good bunch to actually be around, quite funny guys and girls. So again, it's, uh, I feel it's really good to get them in the videos because I think they're entertaining and they show off how good UK sport is in sort of the university sector. Do you mean it sometimes isn't portrayed as well as it should be because uh yeah i've got some really talented talented guys so yeah get some comments down below i hope to catch you soon